today we're going to look at writing a lowercase letter S and a lowercase letter D on the writing line. So for this activity, you will need your dry erase board, your marker, and something to erase with. Your grown up has a paper this week that tells you, tells them exactly the steps and the process, how to make a lowercase d on the line and how to make a lowercase s on the line. We're gonna start today with lowercase d. Lowercase d is a plain line letter. So that means that we will start at the plain line. Turn this around, I have mine upside down. Oh, it's still upside down. Okay, here we go. Now I have it the right way. We're going to start at the plain line. Trace back down to the grass line. Go all the way back up to the skyline and trace down to the grass line. Okay, now I'm going to do one for you. Start at the plain line, trace down to the grass line, back up to the skyline, and down to the grass line. D dog D. All right, I want you to try one. So if you don't have your board and your marker, go ahead and stop the video and go get one. All right, yours should look like mine. I'm going to use my board and you have something that looks like this that you're using for yours. Okay. All right. Now, I want you to put a finger space down beside this big D that you wrote and let's do one more. So go ahead and stop the video and do one more for me. Okay, take a look at my D's and look at the ones that you did. A couple of things I want you to be asking yourself. One, did I remember to put a finger space in between my letters? Two, does my D go down all the way to the grass line and stop? Make sure not to go below the grass line. And last, does my D stop at the skyline? All right, now we're going to turn over to the back side, and now we're going to practice on the smaller set of writing lines. So let's turn over to the back side and we're going to practice. Yours looks like this. You have three boxes at the top. We're not going to be using these three boxes today. And you have three sets of writing lines. Okay. I'm going to use my board and we're going to start on this very first set of writing lines, okay? We're making a lowercase letter D again. So it, again, will start on the airplane line, go down to the grass line, go back up all the way to the skyline and down. D, dog, D. All right, now, your job for me on this side is you are going to make five more, five more lowercase d's on the writing line, on this same line. And each time you do one, I want you to remember to put a finger space in between your letters. Okay, so go ahead and stop and pause the video now. And you can practice your five more. Okay, I finished my d's on the first line. I made one D and then Miss Gideon said, let's make five more. One, two, three, four, five more. Now, I want you to look at my D's carefully. Notice 
how they stop at the grass line, the ground line. Notice how none of my D's, none of the parts of my D's go up above the skyline. If I take my finger space, I should be able to put it down in between my D's. If I left enough room, I will be able to get a finger space between all my letters. And I did, so you can check yourself. All right, now we're going to work on lowercase s. Lowercase s. Lowercase s is what they call a plain line round letter. So once again, your grown up has this page to help you get started on writing your lowercase s. Okay, so we're going to take a look at that. You're going to be flipping back over to the large, the big writing line side on your dry erase board. I'm going to use mine. I'm going to trace and just outline with my marker first to show you what a lowercase s looks like. I'm going to point to the plain line. I'm going to trace back and curve in and go back again and land down on the grass line. S snake. S. All right, let's take a look at it and see what it looks like. So I will start on the plain line just like I would with my letter C, okay, or the beginning part of my D. So I'm going to start on the plain line. I'm going to trace back. I'm going to go down to the grass line and back up. S, S, snake, S. Okay, I want you to pause the video and try one. 